everybody. It's Tuesday here at Ice Solids, and we're getting ready to fire up the HP 5420W machine. I thought it'd be a good opportunity to go ahead and tell you about three in particular characteristics of the white parts that come off this machine that are a little bit unique that you might not know about, other than, of course, just the color being white versus the standard gray. So the first one is the finish itself. Here's a standard MJF part. Great part. Finish is great. Of course, we typically want to dye the part and shot paint it for a little additional smoothing. But here's a standard same exact just depowdered part after the 5420W. Now what you can't see coming through the camera is the feel of the part itself. This part has not been shot paint or additional smooth, but it is a very good finish. This is ready to go directly off the printer. So what does that mean? Well, of course, just save time and cost on the additional post processing. All right, now here's another really, really interesting one that HP just kind of released a new document on, and that is the UV characteristics of these particular parts. With a thousand hours of extended life exposure to UV and weathering characteristics, this machine is able to maintain 90% of the original elongation, tensile strength, and cosmetic appearance of the particular parts just as they were produced. If we compare that to SLS white parts, then we're looking at in between 60 to 80, upwards of 90% reduced strength with extended yellowing on the additional parts. I can go on for a long period of time on that particular study because I think it's very interesting, but we'll just go ahead and post the link where you can download that study yourself. Now here's the third and final one I'll talk about today, and I think this is pretty interesting. So this is just a little coaster that we've had designed up, and you might be able to see that DBOSS logo. That's a really common design characteristic using pretty much any 3D printing, but of course MJF uh, as well to get text or logos directly into your part. But here's what happened if I flip this part around, you can see with the white, we're able to laser engrave that part and how much more that logo stands out by just laser engraving to give you that contrast in color. So that's a unique thing. Not many people have thought about you, that you can do with this white, but it definitely is a, adds a lot of additional features that you can add logos, QR codes, date stamps, all those types of things with serial production with these particular parts. So again, more to come, but I thought these would be three particular things to talk about first. Um, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Let us know if you have any questions. Thanks.